Oh, wow. I kind of forgot about the fact that Nightwave episode 3 for Glassmaker actually got released. Um, let's go do that. You do this by just going into Nightwave and clicking on number 3. Nihil. Worse than an executioner. Worse even than an excruciator. When my tired old grandma didn't have time for my nonsense, Nihil was the boogeyman she said was gonna come put Naughty Nora in a bottle. But Nihil was real. He's still here, somehow. After all this time. And still passing judgment. We've got another victim, crystallized in exile. This one feels different. Can't put my finger on why. Get on up now. Determine his pattern. Gather the clues and get back into Nihil's weave. We can't find him, then there ain't no locking him back in whatever bottle he came from. Remembering that every single clue in here, there was one on the table, we've already seen this one, uh, these are all different depending on, well, you. The different per account, and I've also been told that they are in different locations for every account. I was kind of expecting the... Oh, wow, I haven't seen that in a while. Not only are the clues in different places, apparently, well, different clues, different places, different everything. I uh, can kind of remember the things like this fairly easily. It's the word ones that can be... Problematic sometimes, but there should be five. Uh, that's not one, is it? Wow, it is. Oh, it's... That's a... Core of a weapon, the Atmos. It's actually written on the right. I'm looking at the thing on the left going, hang on, I know that from somewhere. It's written on the right. It's the Atmos. So it's a weapon. So the only two left have got to be the word ones. But these things... I'm actually really surprised and amazed because unlike previously, they don't start to shine and glow until you actually get to them. You can see that one's glowing, that one's kind of glowing, that one not so much. Which leaves two more that could be absolutely anywhere. You have to search everywhere to find them, but you have to find all five. There's another one. This one is actually quite a distance away. This will be the word one. Kill. These are actually easy to remember. And we started all the way over there. Didn't expect them to allow us to come over here. Because usually there's a wall. A red one that stops you going anywhere. The red wall's not there. But it's still stopping you from going anywhere. But it's allowing you. This is actually a much bigger one. That's the last one there. Bigger than it was before, so there's lots and lots of places that, that can hide them this time round. Wow. Actually, if I was doing this, I would be half tempted on putting one on the hook. Because they're always on the floor, it would be different to have them on the hook. Last one. Then we can do the unthinkable. What's this? Oh, it's Steel Meridian. So this is also a symbol. So there's only one word one this time. Can honestly say, this is the exit scene by the way, you leave over there, or you come in down there. Just depends what it is, and I can honestly say I've never seen personal quarters off to the side like this. This is new, and kind of weird, but it only costs 5 Cephalite re resonance now, so trying to keep an eye on these things when they spawn, and what they are going to be, would be nice. That one, I think. Ooh. That nearly went horribly wrong. Why can't I sprint? Can I just ask that one? All kinds of different floofs. Why am I not able to sprint? Kill. Oh. I don't know what the other words were. I'm not risking uh, looking at it. Different factions. I was with Steel Meridian. Which leaves the Atmos. Uh, so it's lots of... Oh, why was it not the Viper? I love the Viper. I use the Viper all the time, and then... Well, that's it. Done. L time for the third hint. You are infectious. Chaos infects. As Grau was infected. And spreads. A lack of vigilance is the better. Oh, we lose vigilance if not reminded. 
This reminder now is an eternal reminder. Has become an agent of order, and so is Ravini. You yourself are not beyond redemption. Colony after report. So this is a little bit more you can see of Nihil there. Because they've got the two shoulder pads on the left and the right. The little triangle bits. So that is actually the neck. This is all getting... Um, interesting. Nihil's a judge. Working to a long dead playbook. Without a shred of mercy. Almost like he's a preceptor. Every society has its misfits, you and me included. But a guilty grenier with a moral compass, next level. Some go their whole lives and never do nothing like that. Respect. You're close. Each time Night Hill glasses, he reveals. We just gotta get ahead of him. How? Are we supposed to get ahead of him? That's pretty much exactly as far as we can... I really need to actually get these done today. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, how are we supposed to get ahead of them when four's not there? And five's not there. But this does mean that we have hit the halfway point. So if you are trying to get to the ship, there is still loads of time to be able to get here and get this before we have to assume... At this point, we are going to eventually, at some point, take out Nihil. And then we find out what the weapon is. And hopefully it's something that turns our enemies to glass. Because that would actually be pretty cool. A weapon that turns the enemies into... Well, if we go back in and skippy, skippy, skip. If we get a weapon that turns us into... Or allows us to turn enemies to this... That would actually be kind of interesting. But we'll have to wait and see when episode 4 comes out. Hopefully the next one does have the new boss fight in this. Hopefully we don't have to wait till 5. Because, well, the sooner it comes, the better. So, we'll leave this off here for now. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you next time.